Hey everybody, if you don't know me or if we haven't met yet, my name is Daniel and I'm the worship coordinator here at Martin Luther Church. Now, it's been a really long time since we've been able to worship here in person together. And some of you might not even recognize this space, um, whether you haven't been here at all or it just looks different than last time we were here. This is our main sanctuary and we repainted it. We also got some lights. We are super excited for how it looks. We think it looks great. We think it's got a good feel and we're really looking forward to inviting you all in, in person again. Now, we've actually been working on a number of ways of being able to meet and worship live and in person again. And one of those ways is an in-person worship night. Now, there's going to be a lot of information about this event, and I won't be able to get all of it in this video, so this is just going to be a brief summary of what's to come. But this is going to be a worship jam session. No, there's not going to be scones or tea, uh, unfortunately. It's not that kind of jam. But we're going to invite you to bring your own non-wind instrument and play along with everyone else. Um, yeah, that's what a jam session is. Everyone comes together, you bring your own songs that you're excited about, you bring your own instrument, and we play together and we worship together. Uh, I'm really excited for this. If you are not a musical person or if you uh, yeah, don't play any instruments, you are still more than welcome to come and hum along. Everyone's going to be wearing masks, but that's what the general overview of the night's going to look like. Now, we won't be providing lyrics or sheet music for you, so if there's a specific song that you really want to sing or play, you are welcome to prepare that, uh, bring your own sheet music, or you can also bring a device or a tablet, um, device, tablet, computer, something like that, and you can look up the lyrics and the sheet music as we go, and you can play along with everyone else. Now, there won't be congregational singing at this event. Uh, we still think that's a bit too risky, but we will be able to have one person singing at a time, and if you're sick of my voice, I'm a little bit sick of my voice. Uh, it doesn't just have to be me. So again, like I said, if you want to prepare a song, if there's something that's really been on your heart, a song that's been speaking to you, maybe an old hymn, a modern song, even a non-traditional Christian song, uh, I'd like to encourage you to prepare that, bring that. The singer's booth will be kind of especially socially distanced from everyone else so that it remains safe. And again, we'll have one person singing at a time. But other than that, uh, we'll be humming with masks on, and so you will and we don't have a date picked for this event yet. We really wanted to um, post the idea beforehand and let you contact us and figure out what date works for anyone who's interested. Yeah, we really want to figure out who's interested before we start picking a date. So we want to pick a time that works for everybody. So I'm going to have you guys contact me. Um, my email is daniel.martelootchurch at gmail.com. And you can let me know if there's dates and times that work better for you or even if you're just interested in this event at all. Now again, there's so much more information about this. We have our safety policies in place. We have information about what's required from you, what's required from us, what sorts of equipment we'll have here for you to use. Again, I don't have time to go over all of that right now, but my email is daniel.martaloopchurch at gmail.com. So again, if you're at all interested in this event, please contact me. I'd love to get in touch, and I'd love to figure out how we can worship in person together safely. Thanks for listening. I'll see you guys later.